Hi guys, welcome back to our mechanics. That video that we're showing you right now, that is for every owner that owns a car with a timing chain. And most of the new vehicles, they are equipped with timing chain and dealers and mechanics, some of them will tell you that it's a lifetime thing, you don't need to replace it. You do need to replace the timing chain and it's recommended at about 100,000 miles to do a timing chain replacement and we will show you today why. Stay with us, don't forget to subscribe and keep watching our videos. Okay, this, what happened, this tensioner right here, as you can see, it has, this car has about 137,000 miles, it ate the teeth of the tensioner and it's not holding where the chain is supposed to be. So it's slipping and the chain gets loose. So if you start your vehicle and you notice some rattling noise coming out of the timing chain cover, then you need to stop it as soon as you can and actually replace the timing chain before it's too late. Because if it jumps, you're out of luck and you need new engine pretty much or rebuild the whole thing. And let me show you now, let us show you. You can see those teeth right here, how wore out they are. Let me focus just a little bit better. Okay, they're supposed to be like the ones right here, and they're completely wore out. And that's a good timing chain tensioner. All the teeth are good, it's holding, and you cannot compress it back. And that one, when the timing chain stretches a little bit, it's supposed to skip a tooth and hold that pressure, so the timing chain has a constant a constant pressure and that way it's not going to jump any teeth on the camshaft or the crankshaft and you see those those are sharp and this one right here it's it's pretty good condition so guys if you have a timing chain car always replace the timing chain at 100,000 miles because otherwise you can say bye bye to your engine thank you guys for watching us let us know what you think hopefully the video was helpful to you and don't forget to subscribe